ஹலோ ஸ்டூடெண்ட்ஸ் வெல்கம் பேக் டு இங்கிலீஷ் செஷன் அவர் ஹீரோ ஹபர்ட் வாக்டு டுவார்ட்ஸ் த லைட் ஹி ஹேட் சிங் அண்ட் ஃபைனலி ஹி ரீச்ட் இன் ஃப்ரண்ட் ஆஃப் எ லார்ஜ் ஹவுஸ் இட் வாஸ் லேட் நைட் ஆல் வாஸ் சைலண்ட் பட் த டோர் ஸ்டூட் வைட் ஓப்பன் லைட் வாஸ் தேர் இன் சைட் த ரூம் door stood wide open so that he could see the light at the entrance there was a vast room it was arranged as a dining hall and brilliantly lighted the walls of the room was also decorated dark wood carvings etc attractive decoration of the room didn't attract him his attention was on the large table in the midst of the hall upon which was spread a delicious supper as yet not touched chairs were placed around he felt when all were ready to begin something had occurred to interrupt the meal he wanted the meal but he couldn't take because his arms were tied he was helpless he can do one thing he couldn't use his hand to take the food but with his mouth he can take the food like animal dip mouth into the dish and take like an animal but he first wanted to get help was about to go further into the house for that purpose which purpose to dip his mouth inside the dish and eat like animal suddenly he heard footsteps in the porch and the words uttering words be quick he understood somebody is coming inside the room suddenly he recognized the sound he realized that this is the same voice which he was dragged from the horse no time to think now they will enter inside the room suddenly he hid under the dining table table cloth was there on the table he peeped at them beneath the hanging edges of the table cloth he noticed their face their faces were black and he understood these are the same thieves who had stolen his horse they started to talk the first man said let us hide ourselves they will all be back again in a minute here they means the family members now we understood one thing this large house was not theirs they came there to steal there they found dinner was ready on the table it means family members will come soon so they were trying to hide somewhere inside the house they planned a good trick to get them out of the house then they could be able to hide second person suggested to other yes you imitated the cries of a man in distress well the robbers were sure by hearing the sound of cry all of them will get out of the room that time they can use to hide different suggestions from each of them came finally they decided to hide a closet near the dining hall they needed a place to stay for 2 or 3 hours till all were in bed and asleep one person said that he was sure that closet is open once in 12 months means once in a year so they felt that the closet was exact place for their 
पर बस who was watching all these things our herbert the thief sended the closet and closed the door hardly breathing herbert glided forward to learn their plans if possible coming close to the door he could hear their whispering voice they were talking about different rooms where the jewels plates and other valuables of the house were kept which they planned to steal they couldn't continue their talk for a long time because they heard chattering of ladies and gentlemen on the terrace hubbard felt that it would not do to be caught prowling about the house unless he wished to be taken for a robber himself he slipped softly back to the hall out at the door and stood in the dark corner of the porch where he could see everything but nobody could see him in a moment or two the whole troop of people came from the terrace there were an elderly gentleman and lady eight or nine young ladies as many young men besides half a dozen men servants and ladies the old gentleman said children and young people now we will resume our meal that we know everything is ready then he continued what the noise i heard there was a person being murdered outside my door i cannot understand the ladies became frightened they thought heard a sound it does not mean a person being murdered the ladies never expect such type of a murder or an adventure here hubbard said to himself wait a while you will have adventure enough by and by ladies why hubbard said like this because robbers are there inside the house but the ladies are not knowing robbers are inside the house but hubbard knows this so he thought this young man and woman this were the sons and daughters of this older couple who had come that day to spend christmas with their parents the door was then closed hubbard being left outside the porch